just had Chris drop me off at Gray Matter City. No parking places. I want to walk home from here. It's not quite a mile, but seven eighths of a mile from here, straight back to my house. Stand by. Positors. There was seven eight boats here. Most of them are gone now. Like this one right here, there was about seven to eight of these when I came back from the market this morning. And the tide's really low today. How many motors has got? Well, I can see two from here. It's a nice boat. I'm going to work about right here. All the way home. I may move in shore a little bit. To Quito. Well, first sound at 20. A pretty penny. Two to three. Three solid. Oh, it's beautiful. 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 Look. Nice can. I think I like it now. It's a real big target. I mean, it's probably eight inches, ten inches long when I'm moving my coal over it. I think we got it though. Oh, sunglasses. Too bad of shape. Twelve. Bottle cap. I dug some of them already today. You see, the bay is so much fun to hunt. No big crashing waves. I'm working out here where you can see all these people. I'm at the same distance off the beach they are. Nice day too. A little breeze blowing. Hot. I don't think you can see them flags, but blowing right out of the south. About nine miles an hour. Feel for pleasure right there, not speed. drop off. I got my first piece of gray matter. I may work this shallow zone for a while now. 23, 23. 10 cents. Five. 
a screaming 25. I never had a bottle cap of 25, so I don't know if that's what it is or not. Oh, it's a really green quarter. Look. Clad quarter. Another green quarter. That's 35. I tell you, beach one is a much better program. I got a lot of bottle caps no further than I've been today. And I can tell you that I'll show you when I get home. I don't know how many I'm going to end up with, but I'm testing it. And I can almost guarantee a bottle cap now in, in Beach One. <coughs> now some, some of them real old rusty tricky ones, you can't tell. But the newer ones in Beach One, everything is different in Beach One. The tones are better. They're more louder. They're more precise. They're, I don't know how to explain it to you. Beach one is, uh, to me, is much, much better than two. Don't ask me why or anything else, because I don't know. This is a 13, probably a bottle cap. Oh no, a fishing rig. I got two or three of these, not like this, but I got two or three fishing things. High 29. You see, I'm not very far off the beach. I'm right here, you know, what, 10 feet maybe? Stand by, let's see what this is. This sounds good. That's 29. It hit 33 that time. Probably another green quarter. I'm also hunting in sensitivity. Now don't laugh. 13. It's fantastic at 13. Stand by till I find this. I got no clue what that is, but it was deep. Now that was a screeching 31. I had no idea it was gonna be eerie. Nothing. Oh, I see it. It's hiding in there.
11. I found it 7. see anything. Might have fallen through. I had a couple of little things fall through. Ring in the scoop, ring in the scoop. Big class ring of some kind. Yeah, I like it. Been there a while too. She's in bad shape. Five, ten, yeah, five. But it looks like it's yellow to me. It's old, probably is yellow. You know, the newer ones are made out of junk most of the time. Yeah, baby. Clean it up when I get home. All right. I like it. I like it. A good spin on the bag with some tickets. Speaking of tickets, look at them tickets right there. That one on the left is a, a 10 pill nitro. 10. 10 pill. solid. Pretty solid 15. Oh, my favorite. One of my favorites. Look. A spark plug. I don't know what kind. I've never seen one like that. Unless that's what they look like inside. But spark plug nonetheless. Got a three here. <clears throat> Big chunk of aluminum. Got another five. What do you think that's going to be? Another five. I like fives now, you know. That's the first class ring I found with an ox. Come on, five. Come out of there. My God, it feels like gray matter now. Oh, I don't see anything but rocks. Because it's still in the hole, you dumbass. Whatever it is, it might be 
Might be bigger than I thought. Stand by a minute. Well, that's not the class ring I was looking for. We sure sounded good. Ah. Eighteen. Solid eighteen. A really cruddy penny. Twenty-seven. Screechy kind of twenty-seven. And that's thirty-two. Might be iron. That's one thing I noticed about Beach One. It kind of likes iron. It kind of likes iron better than Beach Two. But I'm still learning. Yep, I'm pretty sure that's what this is, iron. Deep, deep iron. I got six tubes off of it. Seven maybe, I don't know. It gives you that Garrett Bell tone, you know? Like I told you earlier, at least that's what I hear. One more scoop, we're going to leave it. Oh, it's there, all right. This is it. Don't come out this time and stay in the hole. Goodbye, darling. Down the road we go. The breeze is picking up. The waves are picking up a little bit. You see them? Yeah, I mean, they're not bad, but they're picking up. Well, it looks like I got about a half a mile to go. That big house you see right there is at the end of the street I live on. And I think I'm 12 houses in from there, but on the other side of the street. This side of the street is Bayfront. It's expensive. My side of the street's not too bad. y'all can see that and tell what it is but it's a wedding all dressed up in the bride and the long dress maybe when I get closer I'll take a better shot of it I have a high 25 I hear it 25 cents 25 cents Well, I don't have far to go now. I know Chris is cooking a nice supper when I get home. Lamb. I guess it's going to be rice. I don't know what kind of vegetables she's going to fix. I know it's lamb, though. All right, 300 feet. I got to make a left turn and go on the beach. Nice looking sunset. Shaking. Look, lamb. I told you she's working on dinner. Look at it. Mmm. I could eat the whole thing. Well, there's the finished product. Peppers, lamb, cauliflower. Cauliflower is my main vegetable. It's a good thing I like it. There it is. <clears throat> the ring came all apart when I started cleaning it up. I know it's a Cox High School ring, a local 1979. <coughs> I mean 1997. His name is Colin. Got his full name engraved inside. But the only marks inside are 
what appear to be IGBCE or 1GBCE. I've never seen marks like that before. No maker's mark, no Johnston's, no, you know, no, no ring maker's name. I got to look for the top of it. I got the stone, but the top part, the stone fits under, was blowed off, hiding in my garage. I'll find it tomorrow when the uh, sunshine comes out. Okay, I'll get back to you.